Hey everyone, Jake here from Marshall Music News, bringing you another episode of Monday Music Recap, where we recap the events of last week. Let's get started. Fans Warp Tour announced six more bands to perform this summer. They are Motionless and White, Chunk No Cap and Chunk, Born of Osiris, Divided by Friday, Transit, and Wax. Also, We the Kings has confirmed that they will be playing this year. For a full list of bands that have been announced, be sure to check in the links. All Time Low says that they are halfway finished writing their new album. Green Day has begun recording their new album. Alessana members Sean Milk, his sister Melissa Milk, and Patrick Thompson has started a new project called Tempting Paris with Joey Mitchell of Swamp Candy and Chris Crummett. The project will begin recording their debut at the end of March. Sleeping with Sirens will be releasing a new music video for Do It Now, Remember It Later soon. Panic at the Disco has announced that they are working on new music. Yellow Card has announced their new bassist as Josh Portman. He will be replacing Sean O'Donnell, who left the band earlier this month. Check out the band statement. Be sure to check in the links. We the Kings, Travis Clark, has revealed that he is working on a new side project. To read his statement, be sure to check in the links. William Beckett of the Academy Is will be releasing new music this spring. Perma, a new project featuring Max Bemis and his wife, Sherry Dupree Bemis of Isley, is planning on releasing a new album sometime this year. August Burns Red will be releasing a new Christmas album. Gallows has begun writing their new album, and For Today has announced a new album. Skrillex took home three Grammys last week. One for Best Remixed Recording Non-Classical for his take on Ben Benassi's Cinema. Another for Best Dance Recording for the song Scary Monsters and Nice Spirits. And finally, Best Dance and Electronica album for Scary Monsters and Nice Spirits. Foo Fighters took home five Grammys. One for Best Long Form Music Video, Foo Fighters Back and Forth, Best Hard Rock Metal Performance, White Limo, Best Rock Song, Walk, Best Rock Album, Wasting Light, and Best Rock Performance, Walk. For metal news this week, Black Sabbath has been forced to pull out of their European tour dates, except for Download, due to Tony Ioma's ongoing treatment with lymphoma. Fans need not fear, though, because Ozzy will be taking their place with a special Ozzy and Friends set. The performance will feature special guests like Geezer Butler, Zach Wilde, Slash, and more. For more details on it, be sure to check in the links. Revolver has announced their 2012 Golden God Award nominees. The list will include Best Guitarist, Best Drummer, Best Vocalist, Album of the Year, Best Live Band, and more. Here are just a couple of the several nominees. Five Finger Death Punch, Black Veil Brides, Lamb of God, Megadeth, Evanescent, Asking Alexandria, Falling in Reverse, and many more. For a full list of nomination and the nominees, be sure to check in the links. Slash has revealed a couple new details on his upcoming solo album, Apocalyptic Love. The album will be released on May 22nd. Miles Kennedy has been announced as a singer, along with the Conspirators being announced as the backup band. Check out the artwork, be sure to check in the links. God Forbid has revealed a few details on their upcoming album, Equilibrium. It is set to be released on March 27th through Victory Records. Check out the artwork below. Fear Factory has announced that they have finished their new album. They have also announced that former Chimera member Matt DeVries has joined them as their bassist. For tours this week, Enter Shikari has announced a new North American tour with support from Let Live and At The Skyline. Dates have been released. Blink-182 has announced a few U.S. tours with the All-American Rejects. The Fight to Unite Tour, which features Blood on the Dance Floor, Broken Side, Deuce, The Bunny, The Bear, William Control, New Year's Day, and more, has announced their U.S. tour dates. Amir will be heading on a new U.S. tour with support from Senpai Ravens, Icon for Hire, and I, the, I Am Empire. Sorry, Dates have been released. Foxy Shazam has announced a new U.S. tour. Dates have been released. Marilyn Manson has announced his first U.S. tour since 2009. The Pretty Reckless will be opening for him. Tour dates have been released. Iron Maiden has announced a new North American tour. Dates have been released. Overkill will be heading on their new U.S. The Electric Age tour with support from God Forbid, Diamond Plate, and Sadakri. Dates have been released. For to check out any of the dates mentioned above, be sure to check in the links. They're all there. For new music of the week, we have A Day to Remember, It's Complicated, Acoustic, Tay Jordan of We Are the In Crowd, Upwards Through the Mountains, uh, Iron and Wine cover, Adastria featuring Scott Barnes of In Fear and Faith, Scarlet Letters, Anthony Green, Unravel, Bajor cover, Anthony Green, Diamond Eye, Deftones cover, The Men Singers, Sculptors and Vandals, Acoustic, 
The Human Abstract, Moonlight Sonata, Periphery, Passenger, Coheed and Cambria, Century of Defiant, Acoustic, The Mars Volta, Malk and Jewel, and May Sugar, Do Not Look Down. For new music videos of the week, we have Motionless and White's Puppet, Skrillex, Bangarang, The Main, Misery, Memphis May Fire, The Unfaithful, Rise Against, Ballad of Hollis Brown, that's a Bob Dylan cover, Let Live, M Muther, Hope Style Last, Keep Your Hands Off, Close Your Eyes, Eerie, Sharks, Arcane Effigies, Jack White, Love Interruption, Papa Roach, One Track Mind, Hailstorm, Love Bites, So Do I, Soulfly, World Scum, and Unearth, Watch It Burn. Check out any of those. Be sure to check in the links. For important releases of the week, we have Tonight Alive, What Are You So Scared Of, Isley, Deep Space EP, Hope Style Last, Trust No One. And Jamie Elsewhere's Reimagined EP. For other releases, we have Next Stop Atlanta, Bell Historia, The Audition, Santana, The Devastated, Beneath the Massacre, Useless ID, and Goat Whore. For singles of the week, we have The Human Abstract, Moonlight Sonata, Impending Doom, For the Wicked, Sent by Ravens, We're All Li Liars, Messed, Almost, The Decemberist, One Engine, The Mars Volta, Milk and Jewel, Rise to Remain, The Serpent, and Farewell Fighter. Caroline. Be sure to check out all those and tell me what you think. Be sure to tune in next Monday for the next episode. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and subscribe to me on YouTube. Thank you and good night.